welcome welcome back again today to my channel um today we're gonna make plantain cassava fufu um let's get started shall we okay so at the moment i just washed them so i am going to basically we're gonna start peeling it This is the easier way how to peel it. You just cut them in cubes and basically, you know, go around and peel them just like that. See, it's very easy that way. It's a lot easier. If you, sh so you just cut them in half, in quarters, just like this, just like this. Because if you try to peel it this way, it's going to be very difficult. So you don't want to try to peel it that way. You know, you want to peel it, you want to cut it like that, and basically cut it just like this. So it's easier this way. Cut them. them in small pieces they're very easy to boil doesn't matter how you don't have to cut them I'm trying to cut them pretty and nice because either way we're gonna we're gonna have to Smash them and get it done. So here's a pot. I'm gonna. This is a pot I'm gonna wash. I'm um, gonna boil them in, and this is my strainer. I just put them like this, and I wash them. Wash them very nicely. basically um, planting and cassava okay so that's a uh, cassava I boiled it we have it and we're gonna basically um, run it through the blender and this we're gonna do it the boat way we're gonna do we're gonna beat it 
and also we're going to um, run a, a partial of it in the, the blender. So that's, the, that's for you. So I have to strain it off. So it's going to be very delicious. I'll show you step by step how you do this. All my fans out there, you're going to enjoy this. I know this is going to be a process, but gonna get it done two different types so we're gonna mix it together it's gonna be a very fun video because I'm excited for it um, um, for this also and the plantain we're gonna combine the both of them to, together so plantain and cassava I'm excited to see the finishing, how it's going to look. So. Very excited. And you can get these um, cassava anywhere in the market. You can get it at Whole Foods, a lot of different um, places. And these are the very soft ones. They're very small and tiny. Not really tiny, but they're just skinny. They have the bigger ones. Growing up, my mom used to um, grow these, but she never really... She make like a thing they call bami and um, and other different things, but she never really made this. This is kind of an African um, culture thing, but a lot of different nations eat it. And um, that's what makes it so exciting. So I'm proud to making something like this. Very excited. It's good to when you can, when you have an idea, or if you have to go and know you have a, you know, idea how to make your um, native, native food, you know what I mean? So that's the cassava right there. So, this is going to be, um, that's the cassava there, and this is going to be the plantain, going to be the plantain. You know, separate them because two different kind of beating we're going to do today. And do blending and beating. We'll do it in two different ways. Yeah, as like I said, my mom used to harvest these, but she never used to make different kind of stuff out of these. So I'm very a lot. Uh, some people make it a little bit different. Some people um, don't boil it. They basically um, run it through the blender and. I like to get all the starch and those kind of stuff out, so. So. So 
this is this is a plantain and this is a cassava stay tuned we're gonna be right back and once we come back we're gonna um, get it going all right cassava and plant in full full however we're going to basically smash it and also we're going to do the blending style i want you to stay tuned because this is going to be definitely fun so anyway so so first um i can't find my my beater um that i put normally put in there and beat the and beat these so so today we're just basically gonna go off and basically um beat these and we're gonna put it in um piece by piece so i don't know how long this is gonna take me but it's gonna i have to get it done um because today is gonna be the day you know what i mean so starting off with the process of this this is um what i'm gonna do i'm basically beat the beat this together um, it's gonna be very fun because I'm very excited about this. Um, um, it's gonna, I'm gonna get it done. It's gonna get done today, okay? It's gonna get done. And basically, slowly, um, I, it's gonna take a lot of beat. So, my camera is moving because this place is shaking up. Too much. This piece is in there. So I boil this a little bit, as you can see. So. And I'm gonna slowly add, basically, planting in there also. Um, I do it like this because I take out the seed because I wanna get it nice and smooth, as you can see. So, a lot of people take out the seed same time, but it's, it's either way, it's, it's easy to take out when it, when it bake, when, it, um, when you boil it. So you get it nice and smooth. Because you see the, um, just give it a different look, you know? So I want to keep it basically um, very plain, you know? The seed from out of the, the planting, you want to take that out. See. see, once you add a little water in it, you know, gonna be a little bit different, different texture. I hope you've seen it. See? So I have a long way to go. Add some water. You don't wanna add too much water. too much. What we're going for, we're go I'm going for basically perfection. I'm going for smooth, nice, Okay. just add a little bit more water it's gonna come together and add a little bit of water and as I said it's a tech it's a, a process 
Okay. Don't add too much. Just a small amount. Second. I know I have the the bigger um, beater, but I can't find it. But I I need to do this video and show you what's going on. Let's get in there. Okay. Welcome, welcome back again. Um, today, um, this is the final um, fufu that I smashed. Um, honestly, I'm not. It was a lot of beating and um, I get it to beat all the way down to this. And this is the um, plantain and cassava fufu. And uh, honestly, it, it worth it. And uh, honestly, this is no joke um, beating. Um, I, I, I messed up the, my, my, um, my table countertop. I want to say shout out to my African brothers. This is no joke. <laughs> and shout out to the whole world who is watching this. I really appreciate you. I come so far. And this is the next. Um, unfortunately, I get some of the, as you can see, I get some of the the seed, the, um, the planting seed inside of it. I didn't really want to get the planting seed inside of it, but I don't have any choice, but um, it's okay. So what I do, I do I do it in a small um, segment, and that's what I did, small segment. So that's how I, um, I, I get it all the way. So what I'm gonna do, oops, well, complete this process. Um, and it was, it take me a while, honestly, so, um, this is a final, the final step of the fufu. Um, I'm very proud of it and very proud of it. So what I'm going to do, it's still kind of warm. I would suggest, suggest you to, when you're doing this, you have to basically, um, um, do it when it's hot. If you, once it, you take it off the stove, you have to do it when it's hot. So you just boil the plantain, boil the banana, and um, and you don't boil them all the way though. And you basically start the, there you go. So, there you go. This is my my fufu, okay. And then there we go. Put these up here. Still hot right now. So it's gonna, it's still hot. So at the moment it's gonna take a little while to, for it to cool. Um, there we go. Planting 
Un cassava. Fufu. Tanti un cassava. Fufu. Trust me. It's a lot of beating. But you know what? It's worth it. Because I'm doing a lot of different things on my channel to make it excited. You know? But I, would def I definitely did have to make this. It's cool. All right. Okay, that's it. Thank you so much. See you. Peace. Welcome, welcome. This is the final fufu. Um, I'm going to try it out right now. Um, I think this is going to be delicious. Thank you for watching. All right, see you in the next one.